Yeah, I think that's good. That's it for this. Are you guys um, feeling like you've gotten to ask enough questions? We need to plug that in or no? No, it's just being weird. Um, somebody said it just happened to them in the last month. Yeah, I think with, I think like in friendships it just happens, but it's... It's so, still yeah. sometimes hard though when you're like, oh, I really miss that person. Yeah. That's yeah. it. Want to go? That's their story. I miss you so and you'll never know I was too afraid to try To show you love, to give it up To let you know I might Care a little, care a lot Hold a place for you in this stubborn heart of mine thinking of all like things you used to do with friends in high school or like ex-boyfriends in high school anything uh, like watching friends me and my friend in college yeah so we just kind of and that was just fun um to write about but okay the funny comments that i picked up while reading i don't know if you've seen any of them but somebody was like i'm hungry they actually said that in german which i could read which i was very impressed with myself and somebody else was like i like coffee i just love the random things that and are happening and someone said we need a happy song now which i totally am down with Bam. because we don't write a ton of happy songs because let's be honest it's easier to write a sad song but oh, well that's where all the emotion comes from but this um, song we're going to do is called What Do You Say? Lots of people are thanking us for doing this storytelling oh, show. Oh, I love that. doing it. We're going to do more. So, so fun. We are happy people. Oh, see, the story songs. totally changes the song for me. It's been great. Totally crying. Oh, good. Nothing's good. Changed. Oh, don't cry, though. That's... Jill's like, good, good glad. Oh, oh, I, didn't, happy that you're I didn't get to the crying part. Anyway. No. It is different, though. When you know a story behind a song, it totally. can totally change. Um, but this is a happy one. Whoop, happy whoop. One. This is, song is called What Do You Say, and it's totally about, oh, our, our thing keeps freezing. And so we hopefully. changed the energy settings and yeah, everything, but anyway, um, 
this song was literally written in like the middle of winter it when was. it was freezing, but I had a really crush on cold. this guy and you know when you just like the start of a relationship when everything's like ah like everything's perfect and like nothing could ever go wrong, which it always usually does, but still when you capture that first like week um and everything's happy and you like think it's gonna be like that's like this song goes like, yeah, like I nothing have, bothers you yeah and like it's like everything's gonna be everyone will want what we have like that's yeah. the thing you have but anyway and i love the the bridge lyric of the idea of like i'd wait forever for you in the cold what's the lyric yeah like nothing bothers you it what's doesn't matter lyric? that it what's our lyric i would that's stand I would forever in the cold or yeah something. that one because i literally did that um in january she for did. someone Shaded. I mean, not now our, it's on to summer love now. There's new boys, right? New Winter things, love, but... summer crushes. But anyway, summer this song it inspired the song. So summer boyfriends, let's do it. Okay. And baby, it's cold to me. About 19 degrees outside, and it's colder than I usually like it. But tonight I just don't seem to mind it. Don't like it. Don't let my expressions fool you. I'm singing this directly to you. And I'm feeling kind of shy. I can't look you in the eye. Are you feeling it tonight? Are you feeling it tonight? Boy, and what did you say? Yeah. Do you want to take a chance on? Everybody talks and what would they got? Never look back, never ever gonna stop. What do you say? if it's a, like a melody or a lyric idea and even though we've said like some of the songs kind of came from more my perspective or her perspective we generally will say oh man I had this idea and then we'll come together and we since we have a lot of similar experiences in life we can generally be like oh yeah I can totally relate to that and that's kind of how we work out a song right yeah um, sometimes we'll just come up with a melody sometimes Jill will just be playing her guitar and like something and I'll literally just start singing something like no idea where it came from um so yeah it's always kind of different but i thought that would be worth mentioning do you guys have any questions have you ever written a song that's too personal to share um i don't think so <laughs> no i don't i mean i feel like well that's kind like... of what you do when you're 
a songwriter is like you just kind of share too much probably yeah so. I will say like the first time that we played like never over you for anyone I was like mm -hmm. oh gosh it's just it's a very I don't know what the right word is I mean I guess you have to be transparent mm. um, Rocky Road please we were gonna do we'll do Rocky Road don't you we worry will. We're gonna do the next song. We're gonna do is "Burn It Down," which is our last song on the seventeenth, which is like last week, I guess, maybe. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, yeah. So, um, we are going to do "Burn It Down," and this song is not personally well. It's a little bit of each of our stories and a little bit of like just kind of everyone's general story of Los Angeles. I think yes, but it's definitely taken from like us and our friends experiences living in Los Angeles. Yes. So, um, very much so. It's very much a little piece of everyone's story, which we've said three times. I think I just, the wine is hitting me now, but, um, I'm just I kidding. I think you should say it more. It's a little bit of everyone's story, but no, um, yeah, it's just a hard city and, um, but I love Los Angeles. It's not, no, nothing against it. It's just, yeah. That's kind of it. I think we and, had more to say about this, but I can't remember oh, what it was. Other way. Oh. Well, I also think this is kind of that song of like, you know when you're like feeling trapped and like you're going crazy in like a place and that's kind of just like a, that's like a saying like, oh, I'm going to burn this town down. We don't actually like believe in like setting <laughs> things on fire. Oh, um, and, and this We very song, much veto that, but yeah. double veto actually. But, um, but it's also like, I don't know how many of you guys are in your twenties or mm. like around that age. But I definitely think the 20s are like a hard 10 years or 9 that I've experienced. Yep. Um, and so this is kind of just, yeah, a bunch of our friends experience in their 20s in L.A. That's so. the other great thing about a writer. You can watch people go through things and just write about it yourself. Because I think yeah. observing is a huge part of writing. Like you just see things or people and you're like, I'm totally going to like write about that. So I think that's all kind of a culmination of this song. So this one's called Burn It Down. I got a place and I settled in. I found a man who was everything. Everything I want, everything I want, everything. I caught that liar in his tracks and I said some things I could never take back. Wouldn't if I could, wouldn't if I could, wouldn't if I could One more ride around this town I think I'm gonna burn it down One more night inside this town If I could ever forgive or oh, wonder if I could High and dry in the middle of the night I'm in a show in the middle of my life I'd die if I could, die if I could, die if I could One more ride around this town I think I'm gonna burn it down One more night inside this town
burn it down Burn it down Oh my gosh, that song like is really emotional to <laughs>